back to the Crane Family Channel. I'm Carmen, if you're new here. Hey, I'm Dustin. And this is our little baby. And today we're just going to be getting ready to go to Tennessee. So go see us packing and clean the house. Because we try not to leave the house a mess before we go anywhere. That way we come back and we just got to do like laundry and stuff like that. Are you excited to go to Tennessee? Yeah, we need a vacation. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's going to be Baby Texas' uh, first vacation. So we're really excited about that. So yeah, let's get started. So we're gonna be starting off in the kitchen. So I just plugged up his portable bottle warmer right here that my mom got us for his Easter basket. And that is the brand, it's called Young Baby or something like that. So it'll be our first time using that while we're on vacation. And then Dustin is currently feeding him prune juice because he's not going to the bathroom good. And I think he's over there like blowing it up on him, so that's kind of funny. No, it's not funny. <laughs> Anyways, this is the current situation of the sink. We gotta get all of this done. So we're gonna start his bottle in the dishwasher. And so I got this little, um, like mini dishwasher thing. And it comes with this little pitcher and you fill it up with like three and a half of these. And then you open it so that's what it will look like on the inside. So I'm just gonna like load all his little bottle pieces, like his little nickels and stuff like that. In there, and then fill it with some dish soap. So yeah, like I said, we're going to Tennessee. We're gonna be gone Wednesday to Sunday. So we'll be gone most of the week. We're going to go with my sisters on their spring break. I'm excited. So we'll see what all we're going to get into. Hopefully, we'll be going to um, a dinner show. And I haven't asked Dustin yet, but um, are you wanting to go to Hatfield McCoy or the Dixie Stampede, Dustin? Yeah, we like the Hatfield McCoy show. We've been to that one before, and it was really good. So I think we're going to go back to that one. And I was looking online. It's like $70 a person. And obviously, little man will get in free because he's only two months old so he won't have to have a ticket plus you know we'll probably sleep the entire time anyways so that's one of the things that we'll probably do and we'll be vlogging while we're there that way you can see what we're doing and where we go because um, i like to watch those type of videos to go along with us on vacation and all that good stuff and i'll try to get my sisters to get their videos so y'all can meet them and my mom and all them but we'll see if they'll actually get in the video <laughs> where else do you want to go dustin Anybody heard something like that? No. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fun. Uh, does he have more bottles? Or is that it? Okay. Well, you can leave that one out. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm gonna load this up and start it. And if you come closer to this, you can tell it's got a glass setting, a fruit setting, baby care, rapid, normal, and a refresh. So I'm gonna do the baby care, and it does take two hours, but it stings it, and it will sterilize your bottles and all that good stuff. Most of the time I do it by hand, but since he just ate and all that, he won't be eating for a little while. That way we can do that. But he's got one bottle out if I do need to hand wash it. Um, maybe another place we might go is the aquarium. But I'm not too sure yet. We're just like kind of like here. Um, the weather's not supposed to be that great. But hopefully that will change. Because um, it's looking like it's going to be in the low of 30. And like the highs of like 50 or 60. But like I said, that could change at the top of the dime. So we would just have to see. Um, I'm going to wash the dishes in the sink. So yeah, I'm gonna do that and I will be right back. Okay, so now I am done with the dishes. You can see them over there, they're drying. You can hear the full dishwasher going in. That'll be going for a while. And I'm gonna clean my counter mess up. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. We got all the stuff up. I used this iron the other day to iron baby Texas clothes. Now put that up. After I break the Gallon size yeti that he carries around. It's like 50 pounds of water in it. I don't even know where he wants to. I guess I could just leave it on the side until they're over here so we figure it out. And I'll put this stuff over here and they can do it. Probably the best method to do with the husband. <laughs> and this is our air purifier. And I'm just going to leave it up here because I have to do our room button floor. Uh, I know a lot of people like to go to the beach, which we love the beach, but 
Like you can see where I have already got my uh, video stuff and I'll mark it off once it's prepped and ready to go to be already uploaded if I've already like do everything to it, um, editing the videos, making thumbnails and all that. So I'm going to sit down tonight and get some more stuff right down to plan that out. Um, I tried to plan it a week ahead. So if you see my videos, uh, most of them are pre-recorded a couple weeks ahead of time. That way, you know, life gets hectic. So when you have time to record videos, you get it done. Sometimes, like some days you do not want time at all. Um, and also for safety reasons, you don't want your house to get broken into or on vacation, and etc. Little man's trying to get flies. His belly is still hurting. Um, he's still been constipated, but like I said, there's really nothing we can do about it besides um, just keep it, keep giving him pruning and all that. So we'll keep doing until he can start going to the back of my own. I was like that when I was little. So the kitchen is pretty much straight up besides the floors, but I'm going to start the room and check on the baby. because I folded all of my laundry and stuff like that. And then my husband's got more laundry down here and one load to fold. So I'm gonna be getting all of that up real quick. And then I will be back in a second. And then we'll start getting little man's bag packed and all his stuff ready for tomorrow. So I got his ring straightened up, if you can tell. I got all of those clothes up. It's closet looks a mess because it doesn't have a door, but all the adopters and his wife's like, aren't organized. It just looks messy because like I said, there's no door. But I'm going to be getting his little backpack and all that good stuff for tomorrow. So this is the bag he'll be taking. I'm going to turn my big on this stone. It's a little rubber. I'm going to be packing all his clothes in this. I'm just going to sit right there. And this is his adopter bag. So first I'm going to clean the adopter bag out and just get some stuff out that needs to be taken out. Or stuff that needs maybe like place in here. So like a little wipe that needs to go away and stuff like that. It's got like collision and all that in there. It's good to go with that. Those are clean. Little backup pants. We've got some more wipes. Because I believe this pack. 
I'm not finished. He's got an extra little Mickey Mouse sweatshirt in case it's cold somewhere. Let me fill them up. He's got an extra little shirt. I'm not going to pack this out in this bag because it's super cute and you can wear it. And then like all these little extra stockies. I'm going to throw those in the bag clothes so they can be washed. And then I'll wash these two little hats because he wore one of those the other day at the, the hospital. So, and then this one, I don't know how long that's going to be in there. I'm just going to throw that one in the bag clothes as well. See what diapers I got in here. A couple in here. I'm gonna stock the diaper bag up somewhere. So she have a little setup. It's got like all the stoppers and stuff in there. So that's what I'm gonna be grabbing from from that little gray thing right there. So give me a second. And then I've also got to get his diapers ready for the trip. That way he has enough. I'm gonna put like this many in here and the bottom up. Cause you never want to not have diapers because that would be bad. I'm just gonna kind of shove them in here in these little pockets that he has. And so I'm not gonna be watching my diaper bag video because there's all kinds of stuff in this bag. So I'm gonna put that in there. Some of the things in the bottom. And then he also has this little bag for like a wet dry stuff. So if he has a blowout or peeing on his clothes or anything like that, I'll put them in here until I can wash them. I'm going to put a little sweatshirt back in there. I don't know what else I'm going to put in there for the trip. Let's see. Oh, I was going to pack these. I got these at Walmart the other day. And they are the wet ones and they're the tropical splash scent. That way, get drunk down. I'm going to put these two in the bag. I'm going to put them there. I'm trying to think what else I may need to pack for him. So I appreciate this little thing I have in the back of the door, and I'll show you what I'm going to get out of it. Let me adjust this real quick. So I have this little four-pack uh, thing on the door. Um, I'm trying to think what I'm going to put stuff in. I'm going to set it aside and build a little container for him. Let's see what's all in here. I'm going to get a lot of extra stuff I might need to pack. I'm going to pack this Tylenol, this Motrin. That's in the kitchen. And I'm also going to pack this thermometer just in case. Um, I'm going to pack his... Uh, what do you think? Oh. They're called Dr. Talbots. I think they're like the little boogie boogie things. He goes little boogie out. I forgot I had this. I really need to use them. It's hard to get into their little noses. I don't think there's anything in that one. I think there's something up here that I need. So I got this from the baby shower to take for trips. And it's a portable little uh, bottle cleaner thing. And then you also got this little thing. I guess for soap. So I'm going to put some soap in this. I didn't even know this was in there. I forgot. It's got that. The bottle brush. Nipple. Little brush thing. My hair's a mess, y'all. It has been a busy chaotic day slash week. And then it's also got a portable swing for when it gets a little bit older, so that's cute. So I'll be putting that with soap and packing this in one of our bags. So yeah, I can charge and find the link for that to pack it and um, all that good stuff. And then I will also be bringing one of these sheets because we will be taking our packing plate. And it'll just show you how big it is and stuff like that. So we'll be taking one of those. And now we can pack this clothes. So I'm going to be picking his little outfits out. So i got his bag, like I said, right here is the one that I'm going to take. I'm going to be taking this cute little teddy bear outfit and it just like buttons in the front. Oh, because it's nice and cool. I'm going to be taking this little zip up little quarters um, and then i'm going to take this other one it's got puppy dogs on it these are really good for him sleeping at night take a onesie obviously um let's see what else i'm going to take there's all kinds of stuff in here let's see i'm going to take these little pants these like gray wash shirts um let's see what else i got i'm going to be taking these little dinosaur pants because he could wear it with the matching shirt or it could go with like the shirt with the orange pants and pants with something else so that would be good Let's see what else I got in here. There's all kinds of stuff in here that I can't remember. Um, let's see. We could take this. It's cute for the mountains. It's got little bears and hawks and little deer on it. And you could like put a little something like that if you want to. I'll just count the outfits and get done away. I'll make sure that I have enough. Let's see. He's got plenty of little what do you call it? Little long sleeves on Let's kind make sure he wears little pants with it. So I'm gonna take I'll make sure he's the right size. Yeah. I'm gonna take these little Nike pants. This little, I don't know if this will fit him. Let me see if it's the same size as well. I'm gonna take that one, yeah, I'll get Because some of them, you know how it is. They end up fitting really small for whatever reason. Okay, I'm trying to see what else I got in this drawer before I go to the next one. I may pull some more out of this one. We'll just have to see. I got this drawer right here to pull the clothes. It's so sad I'm gonna start like not fitting stuff. So these pants go with the little onesie that's got dinosaur on it. I'm gonna pack that. Here's this little top. Is this adorable? I'm pretty sure it has matching pants. Let me see if I can find them. <laughs> They've got to be in here because. Oh, they're so cute. There's also got dinosaurs. I'm pretty sure there's dinosaurs. Yeah, I was not too sure. <laughs> okay. On words. The stuff is getting a little snug on them. Um, I have stuff in the closet. But not a whole lot for like this size I did. This is the next size range. I felt like everybody bought me for the baby showers for six months. Let's see what it's in here. And we could do. We could take this little vest. And um, also this little Nike outfit to have with us. I can find some kind of outfit to the vest with. But for the little house, it is supposed to be really cold up there. Which kind of stinks, but. You know, whatever it was, we're getting out of the house. So we'll pack these and we'll show you the package in the bag. One second. Let's see if I can move it back or not. There we go. 
So like I said, I'm going to get in these. Also, I'm going to see right here so you can see the skin on top of these. I don't have another tag in here. So I'm going to be in these. And I also use this bag for this hospital bag because um, I thought it was cute for the boy. Just put them in this. One of my favorite things in Tennessee is going to play all the little pop up places. This me and my husband are really competitive. Um, and if we do go, I'll try to get clips of us playing because I think that was hilarious. Um, we'll see who wins. I always end up getting like one or two holes in one for one, and that's how I end up winning. So I think it's kind of funny. Um, and I have like tons of places up there that you can go to meet all things. So that'll be exciting. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think of some more places that we'd love to go to. Um, if we were going at all, we would have to go to the mineral place, but we're not going to go this time just because Little Man is with us this time and it's going to be too cold, and obviously he can't ride anything, so it kind of wouldn't be worth going. Not in my opinion. It's not like Disney World. We don't really have the baby friendly rides. So here's that. I've got all this set. It's got like all one size. I can fit some more stuff in here. Because the girl, let me tell you, having a baby, you'd be packing the whole house. Of course, there's nothing wrong with that, but my car is not really. I got a Honda Civic. So we don't have much space. We have to pack like his packing plan and stuff like that. So yeah, there's all this stuff. And that one side, I'll show you. So it's all fit in there. And then I'm going to pack. Um, let's see what I'm about to pack in there. So I'm going to be taking these. We'll put a different bag though. Blankies and little stuff like that to keep warm at night or just somewhere out and about. And I got this cute little bag. I'm going to put this in it, but I'm going to fit it in here because it would fit. And the smaller stuff will fit in this. And then I'll probably also pack his medicine bag in here. And then pack the blankies and stuff in this. I can get them to fit. They should fit in this pretty big bag. Um, somebody gave us these bags at our baby shower. We got two of them. They also could be used in a laundry sack. So that's another reason I'm bringing them. So, so I put the baby stuff in there and stuff like that. Um, now I'm going to pick a box of diapers to take. Because like I said, we're going to be going Wednesday to Sunday. I'm trying to think how many diapers we'll probably need. I really don't know. But I'm trying to take one of the bigger boxes with us. That one we don't run out of. This one has 132. I think this is one of the bigger boxes we got because that one has 116, that one has 96, and the other one's a size two. So I got all those from the baby shop. I don't believe we need nothing else from his closet, so I'm gonna take you into the kitchen and we'll go ahead and get some other stuff packed away. I also wanted to add here, my mom got him this thing for Easter, the little carrier, so it'll be the first time carrying it. This is the brand that she got us, so we'll also be taking it in that.
Ta-da. This one's Carrington's. This is a Baby Tex. This one is Paisley's. And I think that one's Paisley's. And then we got Dustin's, Sherry, Stella's, my mom's, and then we got mine. And the wind keeps getting in, but we're going to undo them later and see who did the best. <laughs> 